Hey guys, it's Molly. I'm gonna do tonight an original Dutch pour and I'm gonna be using just paint and water. So if you guys haven't um, seen her before or know of her, my inspiration tonight is Rinska Dauna. I'll link her channel below, but she does some amazing Dutch pours and she just uses acrylic paint and water. And I experiment around with so many different pouring mediums. I have no idea why I haven't actually tried this one yet. So that's what I'm gonna do tonight. I'm using Amsterdam paints that I ordered um, offline. I got them from Dick Blick, but I hadn't used those either. So each paint reacts a little bit differently and I'm excited to see what this is gonna do, especially since it's gonna be with just water. So hope you guys like it and I'll get started. Okay guys, I am gonna try the old fashioned Dutch pour and I have mixed my paints with just water. So I hope I've got the right consistency here. I'm using, I was really excited because I got um, Amsterdam from Dick Blick. There's actually not one around me. Um, so I ended up going to the one down um, in South Florida and in Fort Lauderdale and come to find out they didn't carry them. So I ordered them offline and I thought like, why haven't I done this before now? <laughs> but I hadn't, so let me spread this out. So my paint's moving good, which means I think it's the right consistency. As soon as I touch my blow dryer to it and it starts moving it, I know that I've got about the right consistency. And you want to get a good layer. Perfect. All right, so now I'm just gonna touch around my edges. Maybe I'll pour a little bit more on there. But yeah, it was so funny. I was like, Molly, why haven't you thought of this before? This is so silly. Why didn't you just order from Blick Online? Just gonna get a little bit more around my edges to run off the sides. And you can do this too right here. Just pour it right around your edges, right over the sides. And you guys make sure, I've linked her below the video, but make sure if you haven't, I mean, most people already know who she is, but if you are one of my subscribers and you don't know who uh, Rinska Dauna is, you guys should definitely check out her channel. Um, she is the queen of Dutch pours and she's made a lot of these um, tutorials and she's an awesome friend of mine. So you guys, please check her out, show her some love. Okay, all right, so ooh, I'm a little bit nervous. Let me go grab my torch, I'll be right back. Just kidding, back again. <laughs> Let me get my air bubbles. Like I'm not very prepared here tonight, guys. Like none of my stuff is ready. Okay, got all my air bubbles out. So the colors that I'm using are also from um, Amsterdam, um, except for this one. This is a quinacridone magenta from Dick Blick, but this right here is a uh, blue violet, gorgeous. Um, I'm gonna do this quinacridone magenta. I think a little bit of this sky blue. And again, all these are with water. Copper, maybe just a little bit more there. Okay, I think that's plenty. Now I'm gonna do, oops. 
Ooh, way too much white. All right, let me blow over. Oh, look at those cells form. So those are the types of cells that you get with doing just water. Gorgeous, very pretty. Okay, I'm gonna blow out. Wow, look at all these cells just exploding here. Okay, I'm gonna do just a little bit of blowing. Wow, that just exploded with color. I have no idea. There's a lot of color right up under here. The, the ice, I mean, the sky blue is kind of gone. But let me show you. Okay, so that is what it looks like. Let me take you in for close-ups on the... Holy cow, can you guys see that lacing right there? Wow, those cells are just crazy. There's a little bit of that blue. The blue ended up there, ended up there. I actually like just the little touches, but that, that um, copper, man, whew, so pretty. All right, so I'll see how this dries and I'll let you guys know. Okay, you guys, here it is, and it dried really great, but I am devastated, and I'll show you why. A fly got in right there, and I went to get it out, and I stuck my big freaking fingers in it, and as I was doing it, my palm touched right there, so I think the piece is ruined, but look at how it dried. Just absolutely gorgeous which is also why i'm so upset right now look at all those little details in there and that blue this that is my favorite part right there all those little lines oh i'm devastated guys i'm gonna make another one stupid fly all right <laughs> Until next time, happy painting. Bye.